Hey guys, Nylon here with another Minecraft tutorial. In this tutorial I'll be showing you how to record and edit Minecraft. So what you're going to need is a uh, software called Camtasia Studios 8. And I'll put a download link to that in the description. Although it does cost money, so you're going to have to go and buy it um, if you're going to want to use it to record. So this software does record and edit Minecraft all together. And it's pretty quick and simple to use. You're just going to need to first press or first you're going to you need to open the software up obviously and it's going to bring you to the screen then there's going to be a button here that says record screen and I already have the recorder open and I'm going to need to switch over to another recording software connect so I can show you how to set up your recording of Minecraft okay so right now I've loaded up Minecraft and that's what you're going to want to do you're going to want to load up your Minecraft game and right now I'm in a test world so nothing special uh, you could get some lag with this, it's just my computer seems to be pretty good if I go to my video settings. Um, this is what I have it on. It seems to work for me. So if you guys want to copy that here on your game, you can do that. Just leave that there for a second. And, yeah. So that, now that you have Minecraft open, you're going to want to go to Camtasia Studios. And there's going to be an option that I showed before. It's going to hit, say, record screen. You're going to click that, and it's going to come up with a window. And the window is going to have a taskbar like this. And I'll pull that up right here. If I can get it. As you can see, my screen just went here. And it has full screen, custom, and webcam off, audio on. And right now I'm recording, so I can't move my mouse off here to show you. So you're going to want to go to custom and hit the down arrow and there's going to be dimensions. And as you can see you can write in those dimensions. You're going to put 1280 by 720. And then you're going to choose your audio, the microphone you're using. And you're pretty much ready to record now. But what you're going to want to do is go out of this, go back to your Minecraft, and you're going to want to drag Minecraft to the dotted lines that shows up when you put in your recording dimensions. So now that the dotted lines are there, um, you can just drag Minecraft as you can see I'm doing that now to the sides right here and as you can see it's pretty much lag free um, for me I'm not sure if it would be for you but I'm actually playing on a laptop right now so if you guys are playing on PC or no I mean uh, desktop it should be a lot better because desktops usually work better than laptops so now that you know how to record Minecraft um, I'm going to show you how to edit it, and I should probably first show you how to stop recording. Uh, I set my hotkey to F10, so if I hit F10, it will stop recording, and it will go into the Camtasia file folder. Okay, so now that you've got your uh, recording all done, and you've recorded your Minecraft clip, um, you're going to go to Import Media, and obviously when I hit F10 earlier, the recording stopped, um, so I wasn't able to record me saving the file, but you're just going to save your file anywhere. Um, so you're just going to hit import media right here. I'm in Camtasia Studios. You're going to hit import media. And then you're going to get go to this uh, folder right here. It's going to go your computer name, your documents, and then Camtasia Studio folder. And you can scroll through this, look for the file that um, you had. And I'm going to bring up the file I recorded, how to record. And I'm going to bring in another one of those uh, for the second clip. And yeah these are the two files I have so now that you have that you're gonna drag them like this into the timeline here just click and drag and then I click them and bring them all the way to the edge right here and as you can see up here the dimensions are 1280 by 720 and you can see these bars right here so if yours is not that you're gonna click on that button right there and it's gonna say dimensions 1280 by 720 and that's the one you want so you're gonna click OK and then you're going to take this uh, arrowhead or whatever it's called and you can move this around um, to cut out clips if you messed up but right here there's a little overlap of the audio so I'm just going to cut that out so you just move that red thing over click and hold right click and then you hit cut and obviously I'd be doing this to a Minecraft recording if I was recording Minecraft and then you're just going to click and drag your other clip which I have right here I'm just going to come over here you just click and drag the whole thing back to here click on the bar right here and as you can see it's off a little so you're going to need to bring it down one just click and hold basically everything in the software is just click and hold so now you're going to go to the end again and I'll do that a uh, quick cut 
here of the overlapped audio. So you just hit cut like that, and now you should be able to play it like this. If you hit play. Hey guys, now I'm on here with another Minecraft tutorial. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you. So as you can see, it did that, and yeah, you're pretty much set with your recording. Um, now you can do some special effects in your library. You, c you get some free music, and you can use uh, different speech bubbles and stuff like that. You can zoom into your video. Uh, you can raise the audio level and stuff like that. Add some transitions if you want. Uh, my favorite is fade. Um, but now that you're done editing your uh, Minecraft recording, you're going to go to produce and share. It's going to bring something up like this. It's going to be a drop down arrow. And it should say dimensions 1280 by 720 format MP4 video. And you're going to go over here and it's going to be HD MP4 only uh, or up to 720p. Click that and then you hit next. And then production name. Name it whatever you want and then you're going to hit finish. And that's going to bring up a loading screen. And it's just going to load up your video, render it and everything. And when that's done, it's going to bring up something else. And I'll go um, find that right now, and I'll be right back. Okay, so now that your project has rendered and everything, um, it's going to come, come up with a file like this. Uh, here I have my super flat Let's Play and my intro. So you can double-click those and watch watch your video, see if you did everything right, you edited it right. Um, but once you've done that, you're just going to open up an internet browser and go to YouTube because you're ready to upload. So you're just going to click Select Files from your computer. And here I have my Backgrounds and Banners folder, but I'm going to go to my desktop. And you're just going to double-click on the thing you want to upload. So say I wanted to upload my intro, I'd double-click on that. And that would go to the upload, and you just upload it from there. I'm sure you guys know how to upload a video. Um, but that basically concludes this tutorial. Um, if you guys have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Um, but if you did like this video or it helped you, uh, please leave a like. Um, but anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.